You driving me crazy, you making me mad. I don't do full gazy, I'm wanting you bad. My African daisy, you said that I'm proud. Them boys they say plenty, them boys they got mouth, but not me. Not me. Got a taste, we got you, go drive you insane, go make you be praying, I'll have you be saying. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Tony, Tony Alawi. And if it's your first time stopping by, you are most definitely welcome. So today's video, I am going to be showing you guys how I was able to achieve this slick ponytail. Like my natural hair is short AF, it's dense AF. And this was the best I could do. Like, I know it's not the best out there, but I think it's cute. I feel I look younger. And I'm just going to give myself some credit to be very honest with you, because this was like my second attempt. The hair I use for my ponytail, this beautiful luscious curly hair, is from You Nice Hair. And you guys know I have worked with them before in the past. And I'm back again with another one. And we also decided to do a giveaway for you guys. So make sure you stay tuned to the end of this video for the giveaway instructions. And if you're not subscribed to my channel, please take one second. Okay, take a second to hit that subscribe button right down below. Check me out on Snapchat, Twitter, Instagram. You know the whole shebang, right? <laughs> and yeah, without further ado, guys, let's get right into this video. I'm going to go ahead and take some shea butter like so and apply this onto my natural hair. You know, just get it in there. Then I'm going to go ahead and take some water to spray my hair so it's a little bit softer. And I'm going to take my afro pick, you know, to just comb out my hair and sort of detangle it. Next step, I'm going to go ahead and take my blow dryer with the, I don't know what this is called, the attachment, and just use this to stretch out my hair just a little bit more so my hair is more, you know, flexible and so I can manipulate it easily. So next up, I'm going to go ahead and do my part, and if you guys look at my edges, they are like severely damaged. I just took out my braids and like when I went on vacation, a couple fell off in front so it took away my front edges bit. I'm just going to go ahead and apply some olive oil to my part because my hair is dry AF. I'm section of that half part of my hair and as you guys can see, my part looks a little bit neat, you know. But I'm going to go ahead and take my brush to just start brushing on my face of my hair into the desired style. Once that's done, I'm going to take my comb and put this in my shine and jam and just use this on my edges and all over my hair and you know, just take my brush as well to just manipulate it and brush it into the desired style that I want. So I'm just going to go ahead and section up this side of my hair. Once that's done, I'm going to start with the other side. So I'm going to take my shine and jam, you know, my shine and jam gel, and put this onto my hair with my comb, and just start manipulating and trying to make a small swoop because my hair isn't that long. You can't make like a big swoop. So this is the most swoop I can get out of my hair. So I'm going to take my brush and you know just start manipulating the swoop as well. Going back in with some more products and just applying it in small different sections and manipulating my hair. Yeah, I know my hair looks crazy, but it's whatever. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and put this into a ponytail, making sure I'm attaching the ponytail I made before to the new one. And yeah, once that's done, I'm going to go back into my shine and jam and just use this to, you know, Clean up my edges a little bit and make my hair blend in and lay a little bit flatter. And I'm using a smaller brush. This is like my hair to brush, and that is pretty much it. And I'm going to take my wrap. I don't know what this is called as well, but you guys know what this is. This is like a wrap paper, you know, to style your hair. I'm just going to go ahead and start applying this all over my hair, and I'm going to leave that to sit for a couple of minutes. So once that's done, this is about 30 minutes later, I finished doing my makeup as well. I'm going to go ahead and open my new nice hair box, and I have in here three bundles of curly hair, 16 inches. But I'm only going to use two bundles for this tutorial. Look at how luscious and beautiful this hair looks. When I put it against my hair, I see that the color actually does match, so I'm good to go. I'm going to go ahead and unravel the hair like so. So right now I'm just putting my ponytail in a knot and just making it as small as possible. Then I'm going to take the ends, like a piece of the hair, and just wrap this tightly around my dust, you know, to kind of secure the ponytail in place. Then I'm going to go ahead and take the rest of the weft and just start wrapping the weft around the knot as well. Special 
So once you get to the last piece of hair, like so, that last piece, you want to go ahead and attach a bobby pin to it, and then you wrap it around your hair and put the bobby pin into your knot so that the ponytail is a little bit more secure. So I'm going to go ahead and take the second bundle and unravel it just like I did before. And I'm going to take the last piece of the bundle and just go ahead and wrap this around the knot and around the ponytail. You know, just to secure the second bundle to the first one. Once that's done, I'm going to go ahead and wrap the whole bundle around the ponytail. Guys, this is what the bundle looks like on my hair. Like, look at how soft and luscious his hair is. My comb just runs through it so effortlessly. Amazing. So, anyways, um, super confession. Like I said before, guys, I had braids, and I just took on my braids like this day I was filming my hair and on vacation like my braids should like fell off in front so like my edges are like, completely gone so I'm going to try to fill in my hair by using some spray hair dye like if you guys can see I have some red patches there that's because I applied the wrong color so make sure you guys do not make that mistake I'm just going to go ahead and do some baby hairs and that is it for this ponytail guys we are done with actually I lie I'm going to go ahead and divide the ponytail into two then take one and just wrap it around the other like so once that's done I'm going to take a bobby pin and just secure that one into place then I'm going to go ahead and take the second piece and wrap the hair around the same way and take a bobby pin and secure that into place as well so this is optional. I'm going to take these um, these hair designs for braids. I don't know what they are called. <laughs> I'm just going to go ahead and just start putting this randomly into the ponytail. It kind of makes the ponytail look a little bit fancy. It's optional. You don't have to. And yeah. So I'm back here are the rules for the giveaway instructions number one you have to be subscribed to unite hair's youtube channel the link is going to be right down below rule number two you have to be following unite hair on instagram obviously the name is going to be right down below number three click on the following links right down below to choose the kind of wig you want there are five options and everything is going to be right down below in the description bar in case you guys are confused or need more clarification everything is right down below now the last rule make sure you guys comment your Instagram name, the hair texture you want, and your email so you nice hair can contact you. The winner is going to be announced in two business days. Hey. <laughs> and yeah, guys, that's pretty much it for this video. I really, really hope you enjoyed this, you know, little mini tutorial. And until next time, peace.